Hello, I'm Anu Hassan. I'm an actress and TV presenter. I'm going to show you how to make Palak Paneer. Heat a pan, add some oil, definitely a little more than two tablespoons because you're going to be frying the paneer. You're going to cube the paneer like this and going to chuck them into the oil and brown them slightly. The thing with paneer is you can either fry it nice and dark brown or you can do it light brown the way I like it. Some people even just chuck it in raw into the curry but we are going to just fry it a light brown. So now once your paneer is a nice golden brown, take it out of the pan with a slotted spoon, put it onto a kitchen towel so that the excess oil gets drained off. Let it wait because you need to get other things ready. In another pan, take about two tablespoons of oil, let it heat, add the cumin seeds. It would just begin to pop, that's when you add the onions and cook it until it gets browned nicely. Once your onion is nice and brown, add in the garlic, the ginger, and then just chuck in the green chilli. Mash the green chilli a bit because it does seem a little unfriendly, doesn't it? Let it cook a little bit, add in the spinach, toss it around a bit so the onion and the garlic and the ginger and the cumin all get mixed, and add a little salt. The moment you add salt, the spinach will sweat, and let it cook a bit. You know that it's cooked when the spinach starts to wilt and look dark green. When you put it in, it'll be a bright, nice, happy green. When it's cooked, it's a dark, quiet green. Once the spinach is cooked, just take the paneer and chuck it in. The paneer could have been unhealthy if you hadn't drained off the oil, but you've been good, so you've drained off the oil. In it goes, give it a good stir so it's mixed thoroughly and let it cook a little bit so that the flavors are infused into the paneer and your palak paneer is ready. That's how you make palak paneer. 